How's it going, everyone? Mike here, June 18th. I wanted to go over some of the trending niches and, and more specifically trending uh, t-shirt searches over the last uh, 24 hours. What I'm gonna be using is the Productor Dashboard. This is one of the options or features that the extension, this is a Chrome extension that it has. And it's actually very helpful if you're doing any kind of uh, research or in general, or actually if you're you know trying to hop on or, or chasing a trend. Uh, and uh, we're gonna look at the top three uh, t-shirt designs uh, that have been, like I said, trending over the last uh, 24 hours. Uh, but then, uh, you know, we can just quickly glance over some of the other search terms uh, that this um, platform, Chrome extension, has actually uh, recognized. And basically what it's doing, it's using the information uh, from Google Trends, as you can see here. And uh, it's basically telling you what people, what customers have been searching for uh, over the period of the last, you know, 24 hours or so. Now, the cool thing uh, about this is that, that you can actually uh, search by market. So, you know, right now, I'm, this is the US tab. You can go to Great Britain, as you can see here. So you click on it and it gives you the information that people from that country are looking for. Uh, Germany, same thing. And, and this little square here is specifically uh, for related uh, things, meaning t-shirts and clothing. If we, if we scroll up here, but here a bit, you can, you can look at the Google trends in general. So basically you can use this information, uh, to coordinate your, uh, designs and maybe dig into, you know, what you want to put out there, um, in a little more detail. So for example, if there are multiple, if, if this is, if the same thing is trending on multiple, uh, I guess platforms or, or multiple categories, areas, for example, uh, Google trend in general, and then it's also trending in a, in a related uh, category as clothing, then you know that it's a bigger um, trend than, than for example, just a small little uh, t-shirt niche, right? So anyways, very cool, very uh, useful tool for anybody that's kind of, uh, saying, you know what, I actually want to hop on on a, on a trend early. And, and, you know, it doesn't matter if you're planning short term or long term. So maybe you're thinking, you know what, I have some uh, time today, I'm going to upload a, a t shirts uh, for a trend that's been, uh, you know, going nuts in, in the last, let's say, uh, 24 hours. So we're going to look at that. And then, uh, you know, we'll, we'll look at some designs and some of the best selling ranks, and, uh, and all that kind of stuff. So basically, over the last 24 hours, you can see here, um, the platform's picking up a couple of uh, search trends. So plants grow at your own pace, shirt. So this is, this is Google, uh, Google trend uh, that's, that's been increased by 1,450% in the last 24 hours. So actually, if you, if you click on that, it will bring you to this page and actually I scroll down so it, it will show you the activity so basically it's it, it was at its peak uh, when was this uh, you know this morning so this this morning early and it started picking up as you can see here yesterday so this is uh, uh, interest over time starting you know June 17th which was yesterday and then this is going into today so when I when I looked at this uh, the first thing I did, for example, is I, I wanted to see what kind of shirts we're talking about uh, and uh, are they selling? Are there, a are, are there a lot of them actually available? And, and this is what you get when you look for that exact same uh, term on Amazon. And there's not a lot. All you can see is actually one shirt that somebody uh, put up on Guess. June 18th, 2021. So people are actually already jumping on this trend. And, uh, you know, I'm recording this first thing in the morning on the 18th and people are already uh, jumping on board. But, but if you keep scrolling down and, and this is the information, I, I know this could be overwhelming. It's from the same extension. Uh, but, but if you keep going down and, and look for, you know, other products that are, that are related to that search term, there's nothing there. So I would say if you're, for example, 
uh, trying to jump on a trend and trying to get ahead of the game because and I don't, and I don't know for example why this uh, uh, term is uh, so popular right now I don't know if it's for example from a TV show or a book or something else that happened on a on, on, on a you know talk show or who knows it could be a million different reasons I don't know what the trend is all I can tell you is that it's actually exploded and then going further in this research I can tell you that there are no products especially on the first page that are related to this trend so what does that mean that means that there's a big opportunity there so this person here uh, has already jumped on this trend they have a, a pretty basic uh, design but it's it's exactly uh, what the trend is so they've answered the the Google trends activity over the last uh, 24 hours so this is actually how you trade uh, chase a trend grow at your own pace there you know it's a it's a green uh, little plant and and they're using the uh, exact terminology from Google Trends as you can see here this is too early to even have a bestseller rank because it was uh, added this morning so a couple hours ago but the important thing is that it is on page one of Amazon search when you look for that uh, search term that has been basically going viral over the next over the last 24 hours so this is this is one of the top selling uh, top uh, searched terms over the last 24 hours Breggy bomb salsa shirt same thing I, I actually didn't pull that up so I don't have that information but what I do have is the next one and the reason I picked this one is because uh, it's more of a, a general term you can you can see that this for example you know would be an evergreen but the reason that it it's jumped 190% in the last 24 hours again is unknown to me so what I the reason I picked this one is because it's more a general term uh, and and the percentage in growth is completely different from you know plants grow at your own pace uh, but I wanted to see the difference between what's available so the other trend as you can see here is completely fresh it's completely new it's exploded and there was only one product that was actually matching those search terms now this one has a lot of available products up for sale that have been up for a while but if we if we keep looking there's still shirts for example uh, in this trend that that have been recently uploaded the reason I'm on this page is to show you the bestseller rank so basically all of these shirts as you can see here uh, are actually selling and have a pretty nice uh, uh, seller rank some of these right this is this one is completely different than that one uh, but again th that's not the design that we're looking at so as you can see here they're they're different I mean same uh, same shirt and everything uh, offered you know small little differences uh, but again compared to the other one that we were looking at there's a huge difference Amazon's choice tag is actually uh, connected to kind of a, a joke uh, that's that's based on that uh, search term and as you can see here it's I love my girlfriend so please stay away from me so it's not the direct answer to those search terms but it works so Amazon has recognized this for I love my girlfriend the last one that I wanted to look at is uh, Juneteenth so uh, US politics uh, Juneteenth was uh, recognized as a national holiday and uh, as you can imagine uh, you know uh, not only Google trend search terms but products in every category based on that topic have actually exploded and and I'll show you uh, that as well so right now what this is doing is gonna uh, upload the page where I've looked at you know Juneteenth shirt and and these are the results that we get and this is the difference that I wanted to show you between the three uh, products so I didn't just choose them randomly I wanted to choose them uh, to, to kind of uh, explain the difference in a fast-growing trend with zero products something that would have been uh, an evergreen 
but has increased in search over the last 24 hours. And then something that's become a, a big, huge deal on a national level uh, over the last uh, couple of days. So as you can see here, and, and I'll let this load because I want to look at the bestseller rank and I want to uh, look at the, the exact dates when these products were listed. But again, I, I already know the answer to that. And a lot of this was listed in the last, you know, not only 24 hours, but maybe even a week or so. So the explosion of this trend uh, cannot be compared to anything else. And if, if you actually look at the bestseller rank, everything is under, you know, 10,000. Every single one of these uh, shirts is, is actually selling extremely well. And uh, the, the extension is not loading right now, so we can't see the, uh, the upload dates. Uh, but like I said, I actually did look at this before I, I started recording the video and everything was, uh, oh, actually, here we go. So June, May 31st, 2020. So this one has been up for a while. Uh, May 7th, 2021. April 20th, May 15th, April 16th, May last year, April 28th, May 17th, June 8th. So basically, uh, what this shows us is that this is something that's still growing and I would say exponentially. And a lot of these designs that are on the first page uh, have been uploaded in the last, you know, two to three weeks. So this is something that, that somebody has anticipated, not only because it's, you know, uh, it was something that, that's been celebrated for years, but now, like I said, it's actually a, a big thing in the U.S. politics at a national level where it is recognized as an official holiday and, uh, and then those sales are actually catching up and, uh, and, you know, at this point, I would say there's still a lot of opportunity uh, for anybody to get in this in the game uh, with this trend. So in, in general, uh, uh, kind of in, in summary, what I can say is this is this is a great opportunity for anybody uh, who is reactive to some of these trends. So if you're not somebody who is working on, you know, I want to say long-term uh, products, even though, for example, a lot of this is long-term. But for example, th will this trend last in, into tomorrow? What is it based on, right? So if, if you're looking to, to kind of uh, capitalize on something with, with this kind of growth, then you have to be very reactive. Uh, but then there's other opportunities, for example, uh, where you can use daily Google Trends to build uh, a collection of products that will actually sell uh, long term, and and I think this is a, a great opportunity. This is a, a a great feature of this of this extension, and and I think it's worth actually visiting, uh, you know, on daily basis, and, and depending on your listing strategy, possibly, uh, you know, following this throughout the day and and being extremely reactive. Now, as you can see here, you know, some of the other things, the Denver Broncos t-shirt, Stephen Curry, like those, those are things that I guess you could get into, but again, you know, you, you can't, uh, you can't go against the tr uh, trademark or anything like that. Right. But, but you can definitely capitalize on some of these other things. So, you know, in the last 24 hours, plants grow at your own pace, only one shirt. And actually it was, it was listed uh, a couple of hours ago, which means that maybe by the end of the day, we're going to see a lot more. Uh, up on Amazon, I love my girlfriend. Again, it's spiking in in uh, Google Trends, but it is an evergreen. And then Juneteenth uh, shirt designs, uh, just because of the whole political climate, everything that's been happening uh, has uh, has now. Uh, I don't know if it has peaked, but it is getting to that extreme level of of sales that even you know one of your products, if you if you put it up and it catches. Uh, you know, and it gets to the first or second page of, of Amazon um, search, uh, then, then, you know, you can actually capitalize and it can, it can change your whole account uh, completely. So those are the three uh, trends that I wanted to look at. I'm going to wrap it up here. 
Uh, I, I think it might be worth revisiting this and, and looking at some of this uh, on daily basis, maybe even once a week to so we can all look at this together and, and get some ideas on what kind of trends uh, people are looking at. We can even look at some of the other uh, uh, marketplaces and, uh, and you know, kind of uh, help each other out with this. Anyways, I'll wrap it up here. Uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you soon.